up front at four. There is something about being on stage that is just infectious for some people. The lights, the applause, one Omaha woman knows all about it, but she doesn't need the spotlight on her. Justin is live at the Rose Theater downtown with her story today. Justin. Yeah, Jen, you know, you were talking about being on stage. There is something about being in the audience that's just as captivating for some folks, and that's what they do here at the Rose Theater. They put on productions about 12 a year with some of the youngest actors and actresses. Now they're going to get just a touch of Broadway thanks to one very special instructor. Three, two, and one. Music. But how do we keep our balance? That I can tell you in one word, tradition. You can say she is keeping the tradition of music theater alive. Tradition, tradition. Today, Sue Gillespie Bhutan is leading 30 kids in Fiddler on the Roof. Eyes are on here, guys. She's stood here before. She's been working with young actors at the Rose Theater for the last 15 years. And it all started when she was just a kid learning to stand on the stage at four years old. A great gift that was given to me where I started to dance and then later I started to sing and I loved it. There really is no way to dance around how obvious it is that theater is Sue's life. The lights got a little brighter earlier this month when Sue traveled to New York City to learn from Broadway professionals. Great. In honor okay, from the Freddie G. Broadway experience, I mean, only eight educators from across the country were selected. And what was so fantastic about it was that we were taken in as, not as students, but we were taken in as equals to them. She sat with Broadway directors, choreographers, and lighting designers, now bringing that experience back to Omaha back to a group of eager young actors. If they want to come and participate in musical theater for one experience, that is fantastic, that is fine, and it has that value to it. If they want to pursue musical theater more seriously, and they want to end up on Broadway like those, ready and down, two, three, four, they can do that too. It all has value and it's all important. Sue moved back to Omaha after pursuing her own career in acting. Other hand on hip jack. Today, this small theater on Farna, maybe 1,200 miles away from Broadway. But that's okay, because someday, one of her students just may travel that far. I love kids, and I really love the energy that they give back to me when they realize that they can do something really cool. Back out here live at the Rose Theater. So Sue did receive a $5,000 reward from that Broadway organization. She's still thinking about how she's going to use that money uh, on the kids here at the Rose Theater. And the production of Fiddler on the Roof, Jen, opens tomorrow night here at the Rose. Guys. So a lot of experience and it is great. The kids take this very seriously. I mean, this is a great production they put on. It is, and they've been working on this production for a couple of weeks, so they are anxious. Trust me, they are anxious to take the stage tomorrow night to uh, show everybody what they've learned. I'm sure. Thanks, Justin.